What is up everyone, today we are back with another class setup video. And today we are looking at the Kilo 141. I've made a class setup focused on balance. The Kilo is actually a really good weapon, better than I expected. But the question is, is it a good enough weapon compared to the others? Let me know in the comments what you think of the Kilo 141. But before we get into the class setup, if you enjoy these class setup videos, consider leaving a like and subscribing, I would appreciate it a lot. Let's get into the class setup. For my first attachment, I'm using the Monolithic Suppressor, the best muzzle for any AR in the game. You can't convince me otherwise. It increases the damage range and suppresses your sound. The Kilo has a pretty good damage range profile. It is a bit better than for example the M4A1s. For my next attachment, I choose the Syngard Arms 19.8 inch Prowler. It will buff the damage range, the bullet velocity and recoil control a bit without destroying your mobility. This was my whole focus for this build, not destroying the mobility while also buffing range and some accuracy. Next up is my optic, the GI Mini Reflex. It is my favorite close range scope. It is clean and has a fast ADS speed. If you prefer something else on here, be my guest and choose any scope you like. For the stock, I chose the no stock option. This will buff my movement speed and ADS speed. This saves the mobility of the gun. It does kick quite a bit from long range, but in the mid range area, it feels great. As for the ammunition, I will use the 60 round max. I prefer having more bullets, but not destroying my mobility completely. So I did not choose the 100 round drum max. This is because it will feel like an LMG and it will affect the mobility quite a lot. The Kilo 141 is a 750 RPM assault rifle and it's the only one in its class. The damage profile is the exact same as the M4A1s, 42 on the head and 28 on the rest of the body. The difference between both of them is the RPM and the range. The M4A1 fires just a bit faster so it has a better time to kill. The Kilo has a better damage range profile, meaning the damage will start to drop off from a little further than the M4s. I am making the comparison because they are similar and you could choose which one you prefer. The Kilo is a fine weapon and reminds me a lot of the Grau. It has good handling, the range and damage range profile are great for an AR and if you like you can use a 100 round drum mag. But to be honest, even though it is not bad at all, it will not be the best AR option in the game. I would still pick the M4A1 or the AK above this one. But if you enjoy the Kilo, you can definitely do very well with it. My name is Exceptional and if you enjoyed this class setup, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. It will mean a lot and I will see you in the next video.